From the perspective of the dark forest hypothesis, the Voyager probes represent a kind of recklessness rather than real risk. The real concern is the optimistic rationale behind these missions, not with what we've already sent, but with what some are sending now and what others are planning to send soon. In recent years, a new class of initiatives has emerged. Projects that don't just listen for alien life, they actively call out to it. These fall under a controversial branch of science known as METHI, or Messaging to Extraterrestrial Intelligence. Unlike the traditional search for extraterrestrial intelligence, which listens quietly for radio signals from other civilizations, METHI flips the approach. It's not about hearing, it's about being heard. A number of projects and organizations have already taken steps toward interstellar messaging. METHI International, founded by Dr. Douglas Fakoch, is explicitly dedicated to sending deliberate messages to nearby stars. In 2017, the group transmitted mathematical and biological data toward the red dwarf Leighton star, located about just 12.4 light years away. Another project called the Beacon in the Galaxy is a proposal to send a new, more detailed digital message containing mathematical concepts, DNA structure, and a map of the solar system's position in the Milky Way. The proposal suggests using China's 500-meter aperture spherical telescope, or NASA's Deep Space Network, to transmit it. And the project called Lone Signal was launched in June 2013 aiming to establish the first continuous radio beam directed at a potentially inhabited star system. It was the first large-scale, crowdsourced attempt at interstellar messaging, giving the public a way to say hello to the stars. Each of these efforts is driven by optimism, the hope that an intelligent civilization might not only hear us, but also choose to respond in good faith. Yet under the dark forest framework, METHI represents a kind of cosmic hubris, a decision made by a small subset of humanity on behalf of the entire species, without any democratic mandate and without any way to retract the message once it's sent. Unlike Voyager, which passively drifts, a focused radio transmission announces our presence with precision and intent. And unlike Voyager, these signals travel at the speed of light, and they cannot be called back.